Hi, it's Jaleesa Lachey with Black Tree TV, and we're here at the African American History Museum at the Black Women of Bond Tribute, celebrating women of color and their contributions to the popular series. So stay tuned as we'll be bringing you interviews with those popular women and more. What an honor to have you. I mean, one of the first Black Bond girls, and we're celebrating Black Women of Bond. Like, what an honor. Yeah, well, who knows, you know? <laughs> you never know when, what you're doing, when you're doing it. That's right. So I want to know a little bit about going back to when you first had that audition and you were casted to be a part of this film. What did that do for your career? Golly. It did a lot. First of all, they spoiled me on the set. It was, a, it was incredible, limousines picking you up, going to work, dressing for dinner and gowns and, and having butlers take care of you, your, your clothes are being made, I mean, I'm, it's like awesome. And being a young woman 42 years ago, amazing. And still being a part of the franchise, it's amazing. They treated us so well, I had such a wonderful time. Yes. No, that's so good to hear. So there's been so many women that have come after you. We're fortunate to have had Halle Berry, to have Naomi Harris now, to be a part of kind of this franchise. How do you feel about the roles that they've played in, in these films? Well, first of all, we know about the Bond films, right, with the ladies? We got to do a little better than that. But Halle Berry played a very strong part, better than the other ladies which I'm very happy the franchise is definitely improving that and they are going to get better I know they are because they have Susan and the family everybody's gonna get better with that um, how do I feel about it we're on the right track yeah, but we're not there yet we're not there but we're almost there oh, that's right. yeah, that's yeah. Right. but we're not there quite yet that's across the board yes. <laughs> Well, it's such an honor to have you here. Hope you have a lovely night. You definitely paved the way for some of these women here. Thank you very much, and thanks to the writers and to the Bond franchise. You never know what you're doing when you're doing it, do you? That's right. Oh, <laughs> pleasure meeting you. Hello. Hi, how are you? Jaleesa, nice to meet you. Too. Well, let's be clear for people who do not know, you are the first black woman of Bond. What an honor. So tell us, what did that role kind of do for your career? Um, I think it did help a little bit because um, that you know that was back in the 70s early 70s and I was able to do a lot of films because some people had seen me in you know that film and a couple of Broadway plays but I come from the dance world um, in Alvin's company and Donnie McHale company and I did a lot of movies you know because of that you know but fortunately I had that talent being the first to be in Miss and in, in Catherine Dunham's company back, you know, back when I was 15, I joined her company. So she was the one that taught me how to do what I did in that in that movie, you and, know, in that role, right? And how, so, how do you feel the film has kind of evolved with the so many beautiful black women that we've had become a part of this franchise? Yes, it has, and I really, really, I I, I love it that each time. Each one gets it's more and more, you know. Okay, I had a feature role, and you know the villain, and then you have Gloria Hendry, who's you know who's a love interest and had more of a, a co-starring role, and it's just it's just lovely to see, you know, the James Bond uh, black women to have roles, which was more. Yes. Well, thank you for paving the way, Trina. It's such a pleasure to speak with you. you too. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, it's Naomi, just just one. Just one question, okay. So you, of course, are the first black woman to be in two, have a reoccurring role for this Bond series. What does that mean for future opportunities for women of color? I just think, I just, you know, we're all hoping as actresses of color that we open the door for other women of color and that, you know, we just get more diverse roles and, um, and bigger roles and more interesting roles. Um, and, you know, 
that we actually overcome this conversation about color because that's not what it should really be about, you know? It should be about the characters that we're playing and the celebration of those characters and the, a celebration of the movies that we're in. That's what's most important. So, But we have to go through this stage um, to celebrate it because it is so, so rare and unique, you know? So that's why we're here tonight. Well, thank you so much and I hope you feel better. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you.